Doja Cat deactivates her Instagram account. Hmm. American rapper singer Doja Cat has deactivated her Instagram account after announcing to her followers that her exit was due to how she was being spoken to and treated on the social media app. Before the disappearance, Doja Cat uploaded a photo of a crab claw holding a cigarette with the caption and a quote, Hey, I'm gonna deactivate because I'm not really feeling this anymore. You guys take care of yourselves, end quote. Editing the caption, she added, and I quote again, I like coming here to find inspo and see people being creative, but I just feel this is getting to be too much. The way I'm spoken to on here and treated makes me have flip up thoughts. Please watch how you talk to and about people on the internet. Bye! End quote. Just so you know, Doja Cat seems to have a love-hate relationship with her fans. In July 2023, they had a little beef over the moniker they used to represent their fan base. In a series of now-deleted posts on the microblogging apps, Twitter and threads, she lambasted her fan base for trying to name themselves kittens or kitten. Doja Cat wrote, and I quote, My fans don't get to name themselves bleep. If you call yourself a kitten or bleep kittens, that means you need to get off your phone and get a job and help your parents with the house, end quote. Doja's fans pointed out that it was her who created the name. However, she replied saying that she had made the term up as an alcoholic teen. She, however, lost thousands of Instagram followers after the spat, and several of her largest fan pages also deleted their accounts. Additionally, Doja Cat has been severely bullied for her appearance. She shaved her eyebrows and faced criticism and concern for her decision. It is safe to say that she loves to stand out, but she is clearly over all the negative attention as she has left Instagram for her sanity. Doja Cat with the drama every time. I... <laughs> he's always, always, uh, he's always, you know, the fight with her fans. Yeah. And all that stuff. It's a lot of drama. Um, but I mean, for her sanity, like she said, she's mm -hmm. doing... I mean, I was having this conversation with another reality TV star yesterday, and we were talking about social media and its specs. Mm -hmm. It's draining, Exhausting. It's exhausting. Um, you don't even want to know what the, the, the messages, the request sessions look like. It's mm -hmm. crazy. Some people will come and, you know... I mean, okay, so I was off for a little bit as well, and then yeah. some people came and were like, oh, Jay... You've not been posting for a while. Not hmm. seen. And it was actually thoughtful. Some other yeah. people would just come with different, you know, assumptions as <laughs> to why... You, You're you, not posting. Yeah. yeah, so, I mean, it's it's really hard. Um, one of the social media um, spaces that I really like is Twitter, X. which is X now. Mm -hmm. Because you can just exist there without people knowing mm -hmm. that you're there. Just read comments and just go and like if you want to like and all that. But it's really a stressful zone. Yeah, and I mean, sometimes people don't even know what's going on. Like, you're actually living life is why you're not even online. And then they just think because you're not posting, things aren't mm -hmm. happening. That's not the case. Mm -hmm. But I like the fact that she's saying, you know what? Please, dears, make sure you talk to people nicely online. I think that's something we always chorus on this show. But some of you are get coconut head. You know, they hear what. But it's all right. Try and be nice. All right? Okay. All right, we are going to go on a quick break. And we will come back with the entertainment news still.